Today is Monday, February 8th, 2021. This is Alex, your Corporate Cowboys intern, with another episode of the Corporate Cowboys podcast. This one should be short and shouldn't even be necessary, but it's pretty fucking necessary now in 2021. I feel like it should go without saying that everything I say here on this podcast that's listed under self-improvement, under therapy or whatever, nothing said should be construed as legal advice. Corporate cowboys or any of its affiliates Incorporating associates, associates, incorporating associates will, shall not, shall not be held responsible for the actions of its listeners or any of its associates. We're just a bunch of stand-up guys with criminal minds. So yeah, while we move criminally, we're consummate professionals. We are nothing if not consummate professionals if you need legal advice actual professional consultation career consult on your specific situation within your organization you better come prepared you better come correct you can hit us up in a dm we can start a dialogue email us or you can start a written correspondence by addressing it to Alex at Incorporating Associates, P.O. Box 3372, Rancho Cordova, California, 95742. And that'll get forwarded this way. It'll get my attention. And we can start from there. But anything you hear on the podcast is free game. It's just free knowledge. It's just knowledge that I'm kicking down, that I'm dropping. Some of it that's my own. Other that I've that I've picked up along the way, that I've heard inside or outside of the office space. Working for many organizations, working with many organizations, with professionals of the highest caliber, and some criminals of a whole other pedigree few people want to cross paths with so yeah anything you hear that sounds criminal just might be if you get caught so don't get caught there how's that for legal advice (laughs) don't get busted don't get booked don't get fingerprinted I've been all that. I've been all that. I said I, I said I have one of the cleanest records out of all the associates, out of all my partners. And so volunteered to take up this project of the Corporate Cowboys podcast. Along the way, I'm going to be benefiting from it by having my voice out there, by putting my thoughts into the universe. By putting any thought into the universe, you can manifest it. And so I get my practice in for logic and tact in order to create better arguments, to pronounce my words better, any accents that I might have, completely eliminate them. You you won't tell what fucking coast I'm from if I ever walked up on you. <laughs> and that's how I like it. I move in the gray scale. It's not all black and white, though you must be able to draw a line and discriminate black and white. That's a whole other episode, actually. That'll probably come up next. But this one being the legal disclaimer isn't sponsored by uh, any corporate affiliate. If you feel like throwing a couple dollars in the form of a tithe or an offering, a donation of some kind. The money that you would lose on a $5 cup of coffee or placing a $100 bet on a sports game 
shoot it this way. See how, <laughs> see how far Alex gets with it. PayPal me at, uh, well, that's paypal.me slash corporate cowboys. On Venmo, that's at Alex underscore Coco for corporate cowboys. And on Cash App, dollar sign corporate cowboys. We're on Patreon too. That's Corporate Cowboys Podcast. Feel free and subscribe. A little monthly thing coming in. Or a monthly thing going out on your part. If you ever don't feel like voluntarily going into your pocket and throwing me a, a fiver or a, a 50 or <laughs> a fiver or a tenner, have it happen automatically in an electronic tr fund transfer in an EFT and the material will keep coming this one just happens to be light it's calm it's cool like a criminal supposed to But yeah, how's that for a legal disclaimer? Was it long at all, was it? Why is it important? Why are legal disclaimers important? Because, man, your name will end up in the weirdest places otherwise. If somebody gets popped, they drop the, the name. Somebody gets, somebody falls on hard times and it happens all the time. They choose to pick up a pen and paper, write themselves a little manifesto. <laughs> and they and they choose to employ the concept of a corporate cowboy. Corporate cowboys can get away with a lot of things, but not life. Life comes at everybody fast. And nobody has a right to it. Everybody has a right to death. But not to life. <clears throat> More on that one later. Mull that one over. Think about it one time. Legal disclaimer in the corporate war that's taking place. Corporate cowboys don't represent one side. They just represent what's good. They don't represent corporate. They represent value. Corporate cowboys drive cattle. They might be, they might hold the title of a CEO, some kind of executive, a middle manager, or entry level. But a corporate cowboy is essentially entry level forever. There's no job below. There's no job beneath a corporate cowboy. So as far as legal disclaimers go, corporate cowboys essentially don't need one. They operate they operate on their on their own with the help of associates so as to not implicate anybody in a conspiracy. Last thing you need is a fucking is a conspiracy. Some kind of RICO statute. That's not what's gonna happen with corporate cowboys and incorporating associates so yeah while the communication might be open it's only one way so at least up for the sake of the podcast so there's no way to implicate me in anything you do unless you and I have a prior arrangement, have a prior agreement, are in accordance with one another, are are in an accord with one another. And if you really want to get down, shoot us a DM, email, write, P.O. Box 3372, Rancho Cordova, California, 95742. Have yourselves a great week.